Alright guys, today I'm going to show you how to turn your iPhone into an Android phone. Just the appearance. Alright, so first thing you're going to do is uh, open up Cydia. So, look for... Actually, first you're going to need a jailbroken phone. Sorry, if I don't have a jailbroken. But, open up Cydia, and uh, wait for it to load. And uh, this, as I said before, this is not literally turning your uh, iPhone or iPod Touch into an Android phone. It's just changing the appearance to make it look like an Android. So, and uh, at the top bar, you're going to want to search Android as I have. You're just going to wait for that to load. All right, once it loads, you're going to want to go and you're going to want to just scroll down, scroll down. Just keep scrolling down. And you're going to want to look for one that's in all caps. As you can see, I have a check next to it because I've already downloaded it. It's the one that's the first one in all caps, not the second one. It's the first one that you see. And uh, you're just going to download that. Mine says uh, modify right now because I have already downloaded this package and uh, yeah, it's, yours is going to say, actually it's going to say install I believe. So you're just going to click on install and then you're going to, just going to install. Now you're going to want to go back to the search and you're going to want to scroll up from the Android theme, you're going to want to scroll up and it'll say Android battery I believe, yes, Android battery. And uh, mine has a check next to it, that one right there. It's going to be another Winterboard theme. Oh yeah, if you don't have it, make sure to download Winterboard. Search up Winterboard. It's it's one of the most... It's a crucial app to have when you're jailbroken for all your themes and all that. So again, yours is going to stay install, I think, instead of modify. So yeah, just install that one too. Now you're going to want to go back. Now this part's awesome. This is my favorite part. You're going to want to download Android Lock XT. As you can see it right there, Android Lock XT. That's the uh, lock system, like the square outline lock system for the Android that the iPhone does not have. And it'll say I system for the icon during it, so you're going to want to download that one. And now just go back to search, and that's it for Cydia. So you're going to want to back out of Cydia, and now you're going to want to go to Winterboard. So let me open up Winterboard here. Alright, see right there. If you don't have it, that's what it's going to look like, winter board. So, make sure to download it, and you're going to want to go into it. And as you can see, you won't have iAndroid sounds. I I got it. There's nothing to it. It's pretty boring. There's nothing to it. Pointless. But uh, you're going to have Android battery, and you're going to have Android theme. And those will be the themes that you have. Now, you're going to want to go back into winter board, and you're going to hit respring. I'm not going to hit respring because I already have the themes on, so you're going to want to hit respring. So you're going to, once you've resprung, you're going to, uh, I'm going to back out here, and you're going to go into settings. And uh, once you go into settings, you're going to scroll down to the bottom of settings, and at the bottom of settings, there will be something titled Android Lock XT. Yeah, Android Lock XT. And it's going to have that weird shape to it, you can see right there. And you're going to want to click on that. Click on Android Lock. Alright, now, you're going to want to put the Enable button to On. And to change the pattern, you're going to hit Change Pattern. And it'll come up to the lock screen. And you're going to draw, yours is going to say Draw the New Pattern. Mine says Old because I already have a pattern. But, yeah. And now you're going to want to go to uh, Change Appearance. You don't have to do this, I like it you want to hit tap to open to make it actually be like an Android instead of your slide to open it's gonna be you just have to tap to open it up so yeah I, I really like tap to open you can also choose no but I would go with tap it's the I believe it's the best one so you're just gonna to wanna to back out of there and I'm gonna shut my iPod just to shut my iPod off just to show you and that's the battery that you downloaded and there it is now there's my music I got another jailbreak app if you want me to show you about it just comment leave a comment and uh, here we, there it is. All right, that's the uh, lock screen thing there. And bam, it lets me in. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. And uh, just leave a comment if you if you want me to do a couple more. I love to jailbreak things. It's really fun. So yeah, guys, have a nice day. It's it's kind of nice outside right now. So see you guys.